People go crazy for a Korean grocery store chain called H Mart. To celebrate new store openings, the supermarket is mobbed with people taking in the food and opening day festivities. We're back at H Mart, huh? Founded in New York City, H Mart has been around since the 1980s. In recent years, they have aggressively expanded and now it's the largest Asian American grocery chain in the US. What H Mart does, which is really, really incredible, is that it just gives you like such a tremendous amount of choice. I mean, that's really the American supermarket experience. With all its choices, some folks might find that it can be a little daunting to shop here. I'm going to give you my tips on quote shopping at H Mart for beginners. Now there's one thing to know about Korean markets is that a lot of them will have panchan and kimchi. There's no shame in going to the store and buying it already made. So buy a lot of panchan and eat it at home. That is actually a very authentic thing that Koreans will do. Oh, okay. This is how kimchi gets made. You get salt, you salt the kimchi. They know that people are going to be making them in mass quantities, so that's why they have these freaking 50 pound bags of sea salt. But if you're not going to get that, you can always get the more modestly sized Korean sea salt. When you put this into kimchi, that's where you get that distinctive touch. If the essence of Korean food is kimchi, then the essence of kimchi are these huge heads of Napa cabbage. They're actually larger than my freaking huge head. I have to get this now. <laughs> I touched it. So this is your classic jar of kimchi. If you're gonna keep this in your fridge at home, I kind of recommend wrapping it with some plastic bags and sealing it because if not, everything in your fridge will smell like this. This is always my favorite section growing up because I love ramyeon. I would always want to get these and then my mom would be like, no, you can't get that, it's too unhealthy. So you gotta get the little one. Yeah, this is like a ramen lover's heaven. I mean, look at this. Uh, Korean instant ramen might be some of the best in the world. It's becoming an increasing part of how Koreans eat every day. <laughs> like, especially with the growth of mukbang and these foods that you need to hear people slurping all the time. Instant ramen is hugely important. This is what I was looking for. <laughs> pushu pushu. This is actually the ramen noodles actually designed to be eaten as a noodle snack. So it's not designed to be boiled. Need some MSG. Yeah. Nice. Magic dust. Flavor. I felt so wrong eating this when I was growing up in elementary school. And now they just like figured out that this is what kids do. Oh man, that's so good. You can also get meats here. So, LA Galbi. It's already pre-marinated. All you gotta do is go home, fire up your grill. You can even just cook this on a cast iron skillet. Uh, growing up, like we would go to picnics and my family would go and ask them for like 50 pounds of this stuff. So you get a whole bucket and you're just grilling this stuff in the park. This thing cooks up in like five minutes. Korean food has so much seafood in it. The peninsula is surrounded by the ocean and the ocean was just a reliable place to get food. But yeah, let's get some sashimi. Look, this is not gonna be better than your omakase restaurant, but actually it would probably be equivalent to a really good conveyor belt sushi place. You can take this home and for 13 bucks, you can have a really solid array of sashimi. The thing that you want is the chogochujang, red chili paste, and that's really what you're supposed to dip these in. To me, kimbap is like the quintessential market food. People call it Korean sushi, and that's like an American way of understanding this. There's no real need to get too cerebral about them. It's a quintessential like after-school snack. Your parents will grab one, they go to the market during the day, they grab one, and when you come home, this is what you can eat. What is so important about H Mart is that it's expanding cultural awareness of Korean food here in the US and even internationally. It's organized and presented in a way that is simple for anyone to have a little or a big taste of Korean food and culture. But knowing what you're looking for is definitely half the battle. Pretty much bought the entire store and look, I have it on one arm. Did you know the H Mart stands for Han Adam or one arm full of groceries. Thank you so much for watching and if you wanna see more of K-Town, click right here.